So today we're going to be taking a look at Super Brain's abilities. Hey everyone, Gameholic here. Welcome back to the channel. We're going to be taking a look at Super Brain's abilities in this episode. Again, sorry for the delay, but they keep changing it. So uh, it's it's taking a little bit longer because as soon as I do one, they change it. Um, but yeah, Super Brain's we are going to take a look at today. So the primary weapon is heroic fists and you hold rt and it will do a powered up punch there's also the ultra fine fist if you have the extra one you can do it four times so let's just show you what they are to start off with so you've got one two three and if you've got the ability you can do a fourth but i'm doing these without any upgrades so that it's a fair level playing field so the heroic fist they charge up twice you do damage, I think it's about 50. I'm not too sure. They keep changing it. I'll have to go into Giddy Park and test that one out. The three abilities that Super Brains have is the Turbo Twister, which is spin rapidly dealing damage to nearby enemies, the Hyper Jump Thump, and the Super Ultra Ball, which you will recognize from God of Warfare 2. Okay, so a quick charge is 50, and a full charge is is 72 so, okay so they slightly keep changing these things obviously the punches we'll go check those out as well all right so we've got a weed here we're doing 30 per punch so it's gonna take a little bit of damage off most enemies and then you're gonna be able to vanquish them so getting up close you want to be probably doing a little punch first and then finish them off with that okay so the first one we're gonna look at is the turbo twister spin rapidly dealing damage to nearby enemies I think that just did 13. It doesn't last very long and it's 13 seconds on the reload. Obviously this is good if you've got a big crowd in front of you like these like now would be perfect of course. And uh, it's going to take quite a bit of damage. It's probably more of a finishing move rather than a just go in there and do it and get them vanquished. I'd say when they're weak it's probably a good idea to use that one. The next one we're going to take a look at is the hyper jump thump. Jump in the air then land with explosive energy. There are upgrades that will pull them in but we only have this one and it does something like that and that is doing 40 damage. So that is a brilliant way to get across the map. Do some damage if someone's a bit in a higher level as well so it's really effective. The thing that I've seen, I'll just do it now, is this and the hyper jump thump can be used together. So you can use those two together if you want to get someone a bit higher. Let's just clear these guys out of the way. All right, we do it again. It's 11 seconds on the reload and there you go, look, it can take out a big cluster of enemies. Probably only in the PvE regions will it do that. Obviously in PvP you're not going to take them out, so you want to follow up with the punches afterwards the next one we're going to take a look at is the good old ultra ball hitting for 148 in giddy park i'm not sure on the stats in pvp i don't think it hits as hard as that i think it's a little bit less but as i showed you you can use the combination of the hyper jump thump and the super ultra ball together which is a pretty cool thing let's do one more to see how long it takes to reload it is 21 seconds and as you see as well there there is some splash damage as well so if you don't get a direct hit you're looking at about 15 damage for that as well so there we go do you like super brains let me know in the comments section i'm not too keen on him in this version but i have seen a lot of people use it as their main and uh, the decimate people but yeah let me know your thoughts about super brain and his new abilities in the comments section i will be back very soon with more of these ability guides hopefully push them out as soon as possible because obviously they're going to probably change it again before uh, before any time soon uh, so yeah if you found this guide helpful useful or interesting then please do consider liking sharing commenting and subscribing i'll be back soon with more battle for neighborville content have a great rest of your day neighbours and take care.